Well, things are starting to wind down now. It was supposed to be open till 10 o'clock, but it is going to be open Saturday and Sunday, so there is still plenty of time to come out. And there are hundreds of thousands of people that do come out throughout the weekend, typically about 300,000 throughout Friday, Saturday, and Sunday of this event. Now, with so many people all in one place, safety has been top of mind. Smiles all around. Congratulations, we got a winner! For the return of Sailfest to New London. I love Sailfest. It's sad that we haven't been here for the last two years. The summer festival welcomes hundreds of thousands of people to the city's waterfront park, bringing family and friends together for fun. Hey, there we go! It's nice to be outside and to see others and to be able to just be like back to normal, kind of, in a way. Because, you know, it's been tough just being cooped up in the house for the whole COVID event. But safety was a top priority. Before the event, the New London Police Union was pushing for it to be canceled or at least scaled down, citing concerns about a staffing shortage. I was very aware that the police felt a little concerned about um, the people being outnumbered. The city's mayor said they were prepared for large crowds, thanks to help from federal, state and local agencies, many of which were present once the festival got started, giving people some peace of mind. I do feel safe. I see a lot of police officers walking around, so that's a really good thing just to know that, you know, they are here. I don't really have any concerns. Of course, we're always going to um, go by the adage, if you see something, say something. But so far, so good. I feel pretty safe about here. For those who did feel comfortable attending, it was an opportunity to take in the sights and sounds along the water, enjoying some good food. We got get? cotton candy. And carnival rides. I'm probably going to go on this, um, that salt and pepper shaker, the thing that swings you around. Just maybe not in that order. Well, because we don't want to puke. <laughs> Some good advice there. The rides first, then the desserts. So if you are planning on coming out, again, this is happening Saturday and Sunday as well. Typically, Sailfest's, most, Sailfest's busiest day is on Saturdays. That's when their big firework show is. But a warning to people out there, both the mayor and the police said that that is typically the day that they have the most traffic as well. And with those staffing shortages, that is something that they want people to be aware of and just have some patience. Live in New London, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News.